Hello, 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 you guys. Hello. It's almost summertime, which means swimsuit time. Well, it is. Time. I think it's actually considered like summer now because school's out, right? Or I don't know. Out. No, I think I don't know. But swimsuits are coming out. It's so swimsuit we season. are going to do our traditional competition. Who wore it better? Only it's swimsuit edition this time. I've never won one of these ever, ever. So this time we're going to post our pictures without faces to see if that changes. We've the done results. that before, though. We're gonna do and it. It doesn't change. We're gonna anything. try. We're gonna try. Okay, let's go. Also, please ignore the hives on my shoulders, you guys. I had an allergic reaction to something, so if you see that, that's why. So, I just moved, so my closet is absolutely destroyed. It's actually clarification, it's not even put together yet. So, I'm gonna be using Brooklyn's today. Which I feel like is cheating because it's all my stuff. It's not cheating, it's about the way you put the outfits together, plus we share basically every what piece happens, of clothing. My question is, what happens when one of us uses something the other one wants to use? Get creative, I guess. Okay, this is some number one. This is a three piece set that we're selling on Lash Next Door, which is so cute and it's gonna be fun to style. Then we've got this one, which is also on Lash Next Door. It's super green, super Two cute. Two piece, one yes. shoulder with ruffles. We've got a full piece with a little cutout from Lash Next Door. Bright colors, so it's gonna be a little trickier to style. And then we have this swimsuit, which is super cute. From Albion Fit. I wore it just the other day when I was in Mexico. Very cute though. Those are the four swimsuits we're going to be styling today, guys. I don't have any ideas what I'm doing, but apparently Bailey does, so that puts me at a disadvantage. Okay, we're starting with this one because this is the one I have a plan for, and we're gonna take turns in her closet, so. Okay, it's my turn to style the green swimsuit. Genuinely, I don't even really know how to style a swimsuit because I literally usually just put a swimsuit on and put a pair of pants on, like shorts. This is a cute suit, so hopefully I can find, hopefully I can find something. I'm trying to think like what goes with green, like white goes with green, purple. Y'all, like, ugh. it's a one sleever, so I think I'm gonna leave the top open because it's cute. So then I think I need a bottom. So it's like either gonna be a pair of shorts or skirts. So that's what I'm gonna start looking for right now. Okay, I found a white tennis skirt we could put over it. Or I have this skirt as well, which is like a little, little short ruffly moment that I could put with it. We're gonna see what looks better. Okay, this is option number one, which I feel like it's really cute with like the ruffle on ruffle, but I'm not sure about the pattern. I don't know, I'm feeling like the pattern's like too much. I'm gonna try on the white skirt. Okay, this is the white skirt. It's a little bit more athletic-y, but I feel like this is more the vibe. I feel like this just like looks better. I also have a really cute pair of green heels that I'm gonna put on to kind of like bring it all together. This is what they look like. They're like little teeny tiny heels and they match the top, I feel like, perfectly. And so I feel like they give this outfit a little bit more like a, a fancy vibe. Okay, low-key my Stanley matches my outfit. So since I don't have a purse, I think I'm gonna use my Stanley as kind of like a beach accessory. I feel like that's kind of fun. And I added this headband. So overall, this is giving like going to eat lunch at the beach side kind of vibes, I feel like. So I think my outfit's complete. Okay, you guys, I have been planning this particular outfit with this particular swimsuit for so long. And I'm hoping that I win with this skirt. It's the perfect match for the swimsuit. Hold on, let me go put it on. You see this? How cute! With the skirt. Now I brought the cutest shoes from my house that match the whole aesthetic. So I'm gonna put these on too. And that, plus a little bag maybe, is my outfit. Cause it's so coordinated. How cute is this? Okay, I'm on the hunt for like a cute little side bag. Now remember, I'm in Brooklyn's closet, so I don't quite know where everything is up in here. And I don't know if she even really has side bags. Date, I found absolutely zero side bags. So we're gonna have to scratch that idea and probably just stick with this. Okay, now we're gonna look at each other's outfits for the first time. Ta-da! <laughs> place to put this camera where you can see our whole entire outfit. Ta-da! Same back, kind of. Oh, this is part of the yes, outfit. I got my best Beach Stanley for the outfit. Okay, let's see who wins this one. 
Okay, now that we're done with this green one, this is the only one I had a plan for. So the rest of these, I'm going to be winging it. We're gonna start with saltwater bikini. So I think this skirt is like so cute because it is a three piece set. However, I think it's kind of cheating to make an outfit with the skirt. You know what I'm saying? Because it's kind of like already a full outfit. So I'm just gonna wear the bikini and see what I can find. Okay, this is the bikini and it is like very little. So you can see it's cute and everything, but obviously I need something happening. Okay, well look at the pop. I literally almost never see my tattoo, so I love it when I can see it in swimsuits. So fun. Okay, so I brought this from home because I thought it kind of matched the pattern and I'm thinking I'm gonna somehow make a dress out of this. <laughs> this is gonna be hard. Okay, I managed to tie this top. So it's a cute little bandana top and now I'm gonna just pair it with like a basic pair of jean shorts and see what that looks like all together. I think this looks good. I just need shoes and like an accessory. I need a freaking bag. But Brooklyn apparently doesn't have any bags in her closet, which ah, I need. I do have these basic white sandals I might wear. I'm doing the most I can without using like the skirt. Cause I didn't wanna feel like I was cheating. Okay, I pulled my hair up and I managed to find a gold necklace. So this is gonna be my full look for the swimsuit. Let's see, the next swimsuit I have to style is the three-piece suit, little bikini. This one's gonna be even trickier. Guys, I literally don't know. I literally don't know. I don't know how I'm gonna style this. I'm gonna just put this on, see what it looks like, and then try to figure something out. I don't think I'm gonna put the skirt on because I feel like that's gonna be harder to style. I think it's kinda cheating to make an outfit with the skirt. However, I do have an idea. I have an idea. Okay, I'm not sure if like colorful shorts are like chuggy at this point, but I do have these purple shorts that I feel like match the purple in this top. So I'm thinking if I just like put this on, then it will like kind of feel like an outfit. Okay, this is what it looks like, and I kind of feel like that's good. Like, I think that's cute with the like matching shorts. I can't decide if I should put a top on or not. I think I'm not gonna put a top on because it's supposed to be like a swimsuit. So it's supposed to feel like beach attire. So I'm gonna change stuff up here. I'm gonna add some shoes and stuff, and uh, hopefully that's good enough. Okay, I got these from Target, and I feel like with the black and the swimsuit, they match super well. You know, because it's got black here, and then the shoes, and it's the white, and it kind of all ties together. And then on top of that, I added this cute little purple scrunchie in my hair. And I feel like it was just like the perfect little final touch to my outfit to make it feel complete. Okay, outfit number two. Yours is cute. Thank you. This is mine. Thank you. We'll see you later. Okay, the next swimsuit we're gonna try and style is this fun little stripey one piece. I actually have an idea for this one. It's not anything crazy, but it's gonna be really basic and I feel like that's kind of the vibe for the swimsuit. So I do have an idea and I'm gonna see what you guys think. Okay, this is what the swimsuit looks like by itself. I actually really, really like it. I think it's so fun with like the little cutout. However, because it's a one piece, I feel like I either, like with a dress or something, I'm either gonna cover it all up or wearing like shorts is kind of funny because not really a top and a bottom. So I think I'm gonna go for something kind of in the middle and put on some overalls so that you can still see some of the swimsuit but it still like covers it all, if that makes sense. I have this pair of overalls that I'm sure you guys are familiar with because I've probably used these in a million videos before. I have this pair of overalls and I feel like I just slip them over and it will look really cute. Just a pair of overalls. I feel like that's pretty much all I need. Okay, since I'm really going with a pretty basic outfit, I found these tiny little baby butterfly clips that kind of match the same color as the swimsuit that I'm gonna do like little twisties in my hair and clip it up so that it gives it a little bit more pizzazz. Okay, I don't really have any kind of like pink sandal. So I just put on like a really basic pair of white sandals and honestly, I feel like this is just gonna be the outfit. Like it's gonna be a little bit more simple, not very complicated. 
it's a little bit more basic because the swimsuit really is enough for the outfit. Okay, time for swimsuit number three, which is the colorful full piece. I think this one's gonna be the hardest one to style just because it's a bright color. So it's gonna be like tricky to find something to match it. I'm gonna go into Brooklyn's closet and try and find something though. Okay, she's got a lot of dresses here and I'm kind of thinking maybe there's something like netted or sheer that I can wear over this. Y'all, my creative juices are not flowing right now. I cannot find anything to wear with this swimsuit. I told you this was gonna be the hardest one for me and I don't know why because I love wearing bright colors but I think it also partially has to do with the fact that I'm not in my own closet and so I don't really know what there is to wear. What can I put with this swimsuit? Okay, you guys, I found this which ties in the same place as the swimsuit does. So I'm gonna slip it on and see how it looks. If it looks cute or not over the swimsuit because it literally has the same cutout and everything so it should be cute. I don't know. Okay, we are scratching this idea. This is a bad idea. Okay, you guys, I think I may have found something. Now, hear me out. This may seem crazy at first, but this was kind of the sheer concept I was going for originally. And I think it actually looks, I'm gonna tuck these in, pretty cute underneath this white. And then I'm gonna put on like some bottoms and see what that looks like. Okay, outfit number three, reveal. Cute overalls. Thank wow, you. we went kind of very different. We went very different. I was going for more just like your average day. I was like, I'm a boho beach girl, but we did pick out the same, the same shoes. shoes again. Very similar. All right, let's see who votes what. All right, you guys, it's time for the last swimsuit, which is this blue one, and I'm hoping this one is easy because the last one I was struggling hard with. So first things first, let me put it on. This is a very cute swimsuit. Now I have to figure out what to style to fit sort of like the color scheme into the closet we go again. Okay, I see that there's lots of like purples and blues and pinks, and she does have this purple romper here that I feel like could complement it well. So I'm gonna put it on and let's see. This was definitely the easiest one yet. Even the one I had planned was not this easy. I just threw this purple romper on on top of it. Looks super cute. I'm gonna put this little bandana in my hair and we are calling it a day on this outfit. Okay, full outfit reveal. We've got the headband, bandana, swimsuit peeking out with the romper, and the white sandals. This feels very cute to me. I should be winning this round. I'll be so mad if I don't win this round. All right, we are on our final swimsuit. It's like a blue bikini floral plant swimsuit. I have actually a little bit of an idea of what I'm gonna do. I think I'm just gonna wear a basic pair of shorts because the top is so cute. We're gonna start there and see what I can come up with. I have this basic pair of shorts I think I can wear with obviously the top. Then I have a hat. Actually, I have two. I have pink and white. So I think either one of these would go, so I'm gonna see which one looks the cutest. I've obviously got the top with the shorts, which I think is a nice like basic start. I think I'm gonna leave these white sandals on because I don't have anything better to wear. Now the question becomes if pink is the better hat, or white. Actually, I think I like white better. I kinda like the white better. Okay, right, this is the white. I'm gonna try on the pink now. This is the pink. I definitely, I definitely like the white better. I think it fits better, and I think it looks better with the whole outfit. So I'm gonna switch back to the white. Cute! Done! Ta-da! to post and see what the votes are. You guys, you already know what happened. I, you already know what happened. I have lost. <laughs> Bailey lost again. Okay, we've got this outfit, which Brooklyn won the votes for with the bucket hat. We've got this outfit, which she won with the overalls. This outfit, which she won with the shoes. And this outfit, which I won with the skirt. The only, only one so, I, I lost three-fourths again. Woo! And I know we said we were gonna cover faces, but we didn't end up covering faces, and now I regret not covering faces because I think I would've won. Well, how do you cover faces when your hair's part of the style? <sighs> Until next time, you guys. 
Okay, you guys. All thanks right. for watching.